we are live and we are rocking and I'm excited to be here with you as I always am. It is, today's show is all about stretching and consistency and I know you guys and gals are excited about that. Um, just to, you know, this is Coach Manny's weekly program. We moved it to noon, so I hope that got a more of you out there into the flow because 10.30 we found wasn't a really good time. So, And we thought with the summer everybody would be gone by noon, but so we're on a new time. This is uh, Coach Manny's Live on Selling, and we are sponsored by 90 Days to Your Success, How to Get More Done in 90 Days Than Most People Get Done All Year. So when you want results, you have to stretch consistently. And I, I love this quote from one of my uh, favorite people and a, a mentor as well, Les Brown, which says, if you put yourself in a position where you have to stretch outside your comfort zone, then you're, gonna, then you're forced to expand your consciousness. We talk about consistency all over the place, don't we? I love to share about consistency, and I've done some great stuff, and we've talked about it. In fact, my number one video, which I'm going to put the link out there for you, is exactly on consistency, believe it or not. And this thing has had thousands of people look at it, and I, it won, it blows everything else I do away. So I'm, I'm no, I know consistency is uh, like one of those things that people really have to have out there. You'll see so you'll see why so many people believe it. Just watch the video. Today, I want to add one thing to consistency, which will make it so much more powerful. And that secret ingredient is stretch. If you're consistent and you stretch, you'll be amazed by the results. You'll be amazed at how you take that goal and exceed it by miles. Stretch is the magic ingredient that will make consistency explode, explode with tangible results. Let me share a couple of uh, examples with you about consistency today and the stretch. But first, let me tell you who I am. I'm Coach Manny. And um, as always, I'm excited to be here with you. I help business owners to double their sales by helping them to build a sales process that excels. I help you build that strategic plan, that tactical plan. I help you execute, and I help you be accountable. It's an action-oriented program that helps you to get things done. And that's why we base it all on using our 90 dates to success process. I do one thing to help you start down that run, to help you start executing, and see what happens when I don't turn my phone off. Jeez, sorry about that. I have to apologize for that. Um, let me just, yeah, there we go. <laughs> sorry about that. So. Um, if you're struggling with generating business, let's get you back on track. If your sales team isn't producing for you, let's clean it up. And if you need to hire your first salesperson, or maybe you need to hire a new salesperson, or maybe you just are thinking about it, let's talk before you make that move. You don't know how many times I've worked with companies and they don't call me until they've went through two or three iterations of having the wrong salesperson there. And it can be costly and waste a lot of time in your growth process. So I encourage you, get a hold of me. Let me help you. So the question for today is, are you stretching consistently? And I ask you, uh, please share this with uh, anyone you know out there. Um, and, um, uh, Bring them in. Let them know we're here. I'm personally so excited to be here with you. And um, if you share this, we'll get more people out here and more people can learn about the stretch, right? So if you're just joining us, let me just recap what we started out with and which is 
today's topic, when you want results, you have to stretch consistently. If you put yourself in that position where you're ready to stretch, you'd be amazed at what happens. And again, I shared that video with you, which will teach you a little bit about that. But let's go through a couple of examples on how stretch and consistency drive and work together to create more success for you. So the first point is, I'll, I'll tell the story, and I, I love to tell the story. You know, if you know me, and if you're anywhere in this neighborhood, you know I'm a walking guy, and I'm everybody within, you know, all the blocks where you can walk around here has seen me walk. But I had a goal that I, I wanted to walk two miles a day, and I wanted, you know, which gives you about 60, 62 miles a month, depending on the month, right? So consistency of walking every day would make this happen. It would make it achievable. However, the question always is when you're, when you're on this kind of program, whether you're running or you're walking is, what happens when you miss a day? What happens when it rains and you don't feel like going on a treadmill? So I added one more ingredient. And that ingredient was stretch. And the stretch was, instead of walking two miles a day, I walk three. And I stretched out how much I was putting in. And I know it's a simple example, but follow me for a minute. My results told the story. You see, when I missed a day, if I had two stretch days, it was okay because I had already covered it. My results, of course, told the story. I had a tough month and actually missed seven days out there. But my consistency was a bit off. However, because I added that little ingredient of stretch and I walked three miles, I ended up walking 67 miles, which meant I was over target. And how did I do that? because I stretched the consistency. It's good to consistently walk that two miles every day, but by stretching it to three, I added stretch to consistency and it worked. Let me give you another example. And I'm actually, at the end, gonna give you an example here. I'm just listening, it's so windy out here today, it's unbelievable. All right, so let's take it to sales because I know every one of you out there is so interested in sales. So how do you apply that to sales, Manny? Well, I need to meet face-to-face -face with 20 people a month to close the amount of business that my goal is set to. And if I have a target of meeting with a person every day for an average of 20 work days a month, the goal gets met. But again, we know that life happens, and so there will be days, because of whatever reasons, you can't do a one-on-one. -on -one. Yet, if I stretch some days and do two or even three in a day, I'll match my goal, or I could even exceed my goal and reach the stretch goal of 25. So what I did, and it's not just me, I helped other people implement this same process, and I want you to follow me here, but you'll see how this works. I lost my train of thought there. <laughs> I implemented it, and here's what happened. I missed some days. Yet, when I looked at the end of the month, we had 26 one-on-ones done, which is six over goal. And total, this is, I'm one over my stretch goal. Now think about how you could apply this to the things in your life and business. Debt payoff, let's look at that. Just something as simple, and, and it's not always simple because sometimes that it really makes you work hard. Debt payoff, consistently paying a thousand dollars a month. What if you stretched it to fifteen hundred? Or maybe you're not that high. Maybe it's a hundred dollars and you stretched it to one twenty. 
What about cold calls or just follow-up calls or just consistency? You know, you say, I'm going to do 50 a day. What if you stretched it to 75 or 100? You see, stretch, it makes it happen. And what I'm trying to get across to you today is consistency makes it happen. And I've told you that time and time again. But now, to that consistency, I want you to stretch yourself even further because your results are going to be even greater. And think about that for a minute. I, I did it with the walk, right? All I did was stretch what I did every day, and I made it. And we did it with the sales. All I did was stretch what I did every day, and I made it. So think about that. When you're paying off something, stretch a little bit. When you're making calls, stretch a little bit. And watch what happens. To find the consistency you need for, like in calls, I got to make calls every day. To find the stretch, this is how many I think I can do, but I can do so many more. Not too many, but stretch and then execute, and you're going to be simply amazed. Now, we're going to actually give you something here. We're going to let you, we're going to give you a, a, a way to try this and actually do it. So stick with us. But let me just, Take a break here for a moment and go to our sponsor, uh, 90 Days to Your Success. What if you had a tool that could help you get things done faster, more consistent, with greater results? What if you could cut the procrastination that we all deal with? I mean, we like to say we don't, but what if you could cut that by tremendous amounts? What if you could produce more consistent outcomes? 90 Days to Success. How to get more done in less times. Are you in? How to get more done in 90 days than many people get done in a whole year. You see, we help you break your year into four 90-day periods. And then, after the first three, you probably already did everything you wanted for the whole year. And the final period is all gravy. Successful people, remember, do more by noon than most people do all day long. And I can tell you that, you know, I'm a consistent, and there's that word, five o'clock up, but I'm thinking about stretching it to four. Why? Because I can do more that way. So if you're ready for the 90 days to success in your business, life, or career, ready to get more done, ready to for more time, ready to dump the frustration, then you gotta get in on this tool. 90 days to your success. And I'm going to put that link out there so you can also have that in case you want to go there. You know, we always like to share. Let's get back. Point three today is really an exercise. And I want you to try this. I want you to put consistency and stretch together. And you'll be amazed at what you're able to do. So take a goal that you have in your work that seems to be giving you trouble. Every month you try to hit this goal and you're just not making it. Let's find one of those goals. Pick one and track it over the month. And this way we can, if, if I need to get it into a month because that way we'll break it down into days and then stretch some days and watch what happens. Let's, let's say, I'm gonna give you a real simple example. 